what's up guys so i have been using this hyper zk v4 rom uh, os 0.1.0.5.0 uh, whatever it is so before i give you the full video with all the recordings of the gameplays and all uh, let me give you a quick overview of what it has or what are the benefits of it so you get this option uh, the unlimited photos option in uh, google photos so guys uh, it also has this hyper zk lab thing a uh, lot of uh, extras are here enable uh, this uh, dynamic island and ios dynamic island whatever also uh, if you are closing apps then uh, they have the ios transition style as well uh, let me check that it is there i've seen it somewhere uh, this is the missed uh, uh, the thing which i like is that it is here you don't have to go and change it inside your additional settings anyways uh, status bar clock style uh, you can change that a lot of things are there you know like wi-fi uh, style is there mobile data i'm just keeping the default i haven't changed anything enhance notifications and a lot of customizations are there extra dim means your device will be more dimmer uh, than the current so anyways uh, this is uh, the extra now let me show you another extras which uh, is a much needed one i am waiting uh, till when the poco f6 team adds it uh, it is would be in display mm, yeah this thing display resolution by default uh, poco f6 runs on uh, 1.5k resolution which drains a, a little bit more battery can say uh, but with fhd uh, you can uh, may save like around 30 minutes of battery life now talking about battery life sot you can get around around uh, six to seven hours on average or even eight hours you can get easily uh, let me check if i have screenshots or anything just uh, referring to my comment in this uh, poco f6 group which i posted and you can see the sot here is at 63 percent and uh, the six hours was used and i just uh, literally said it that uh, if you are not gaming then you can get easily eight to nine hours you get unlimited uh, google photos as well and option to change the screen resolution now let's uh, come to the nitpickings what i have with this you know what the screen uh, mean the usage feels laggy and maybe it is because of the custom kernel that dev has done like no miui rom can give you eight to nine hours this is giving because of the custom kernel uh, he is using so maybe it's uh, because of that the device feels laggy. I faced uh, screen uh, freeze issues three times. Once during uh, setup uh, when I was typing my Wi-Fi password and other things as well. So uh, yeah, and in gaming it uh, does lag. Uh, I mean you will not feel it in the first match, but after second match uh, it literally. It, uh, I mean yeah, this is not made for gaming, guys. This Hyper ZK V4. You can use it definitely if you want to. If you want an overall uh, normal phone, but are we buying Poco F6 or something like that for only normal usage? No, right? You are buying it for pure performance. So, for performance, this is a skip. And uh, why I am saying that, you will get it in the next section of the videos. Uh, see ya, guys. So, guys, uh, let me show you the screen freeze bug, which I was uh, going to show. People don't believe. So, yeah. Screen has, uh, I don't know does not work nothing even i'm pressing the power button it doesn't work as well so skip this room guys this is not worth it anyways i have to uh, force reboot now so yeah